Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living and return on having. When we do this, we have to remember which side our bread is buttered on. That's a phrase in which my father used to utter to us as children. He used to impress upon us that the people who pay our salaries, the people that provide us our, well, our paltry penance, if you will, and what I mean is, and I'm trying to remember what the word used to be, but we used to get money for doing simple chores, I guess, and I can't even remember what the word is now, I'm so old. But the reality is that the people who provide for us are the people that we're the most loyal to. When we make a decision to be selfish, when we make a decision to interfere with someone else's life, rights, or anything else, we lose our own rights to, well, Stupidville. You see, your job in a company is your job, but your job becomes not your job when you break company rules. Something I know that companies are very, very sensitive to are employees that put their companies at legal risk. Legal risk is when a company employee makes a foolish, emotional, immature decision based on a whim of, I don't like seeing this, so I'm going to do this. That is not your lawful right. Every human being knows that there are, at minimum and maximum, the three R's of life. The three R's of life is the role that you play in your company. What is it, its actual job title called? The rules of your company usually relate to the industry standards, the national or federal laws, the state laws, any local municipality laws about diversity, ethnicity, things like this, as well as then the rules of a company, the codes of ethics, like thou shall not step outside the boundaries of thy job to pretend to be the president of our company. That's a pretty big thing, because any action that an employee takes without consulting HR or marketing or legal that has nothing to do with their job usually can be scrutinized and usually, usually will be, I would say, hate to say it, utilized, if you will, and that they can end up in jail. You see, you put your company at risk, and the jail might mean a simple aspect of I'm losing my job today because I violated our code of ethics. I took upon my life, I took upon my situation, duties and responsibilities that were not assigned to me, that were not asked of me to do, and I put my company at a legal or lethal risk because I made decisions based on my own opinion, not based on any process or any procedure or any policy of my corporation. 